Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. This is Sarah with Find Me in the Clearance Aisle and I am back today with a, another Dollar Tree haul. I hope everyone is having a great day. Um, I have a lot of random stuff. You guys already know it's just going to be a little bit of this and a little bit of that. Um, but hopefully you're going to find some things to add to your list. Um, so let's get started. All right. Um, so the first thing I got, I've bought these before. Um, I actually love these for card games, um, or if you collect cards, these are the two pack. These are lock top. It says snack. So yeah, I guess you could put a snack in it. Um, it's what it's used for, but a deck of cards fits in this perfectly. My kids love games and we have all kinds of card games. Um, and this is the only way like my Uno cards are just regular deck of cards. Um, our old maid cards. I don't even know what kind of, we have all these kind of like little kids card games. Um, but also too, the reason I actually got these because all of those card games pretty much are in these containers, but I got this for my son's Pokemon cards. Um, so he doesn't have a whole, whole lot, but he has enough that I'm like, we need to find somewhere to put these. Um, so if you are a card collector, um, or, um, even if maybe you need this for work and you want to put like little business cards in it, um, that people give you, um, that's a really good idea too. Also for snacks, but we use it for a different purpose. That's what I love about the Dollar Tree is you can find so many things in there that you can use for other things. So anyway, he needed this. So I got him, he picked out the color, I got him that. Um, and then just picked up, this is the icebreakers, ice cubes. Um, not a whole lot in here, but really good to just throw in your, your bag. Um, I'm always needing gum. I feel like at work. And so it's just easy to kind of put in my work bag. All right. Then we needed some more of the fluoride rinse. This is kids bubble gum, 18 fluid ounces. We actually love this. Um, and we were just completely out. So I picked up another one of these. If you watched my previous haul, if not, make sure you go check it out. I found the blue ones of these, um, which smell amazing. Um, and they actually feel really good on your skin. We tried it out. Um, this is, um, has vanilla scent body butter and it is so good. It's a rich, creamy body butter packed with shea butter, coconut oil, and aloe. And it is, it smells so good. And I don't know, I don't know. I don't know the company. It's made in New York, um, but it smells amazing. And the other one, yeah, they're not open. <clears throat> you do have to check if you find these in your store. <clears throat> Excuse me. Sorry. Allergies are driving me crazy. Anybody else have allergy issues? <laughs> Let me know. Um, anyway, these were, um, kind of where the trying to think these were in a different location at a different dollar tree than the blue ones that I found. Um, but they were, these were over in like the, um, shower gel section. So anyway, these smell really, really good, really, really good. And the texture, like it's really smooth on your skin, if that makes any sense. But anyway, smells wonderful. Okay, you have to excuse me, I don't have any makeup on. Um, I just dropped my daughter off at work. So I'm like, oh, gotta show you guys what I got. Okay, so Father's Day is coming up and the Dollar Tree has so many amazing items. So go check out the Dollar Tree. Uh, I just literally went the other day, went again, um, and they had new stuff out. So, and of course, every Dollar Tree you go to is a little bit different. So make sure you check out more than one. Um, but they have these coasters. Look at this. Coasters. Look at that. Look how cute they are. They're for your car. So I got this for my uncle. He lives on the lake um, and he loves to go fishing. And so I wanted to get him, I always get him something for Father's Day. Um, my dad is no longer with us. Um, so Father's Day can be hard for me. Um, so I like to um, buy things for other people for, for Father's Day. So I got these for my uncle. Now they had a couple different, let me show you. Um, I got this one as well. This says, don't mess up my ride. And you don't even have to have this for Father's Day. This could be, you know, you can use it for yourself. You can use it for literally anything. 
Um, but look how cute. And the packaging is amazing. I absolutely love it. Um, but these are just two of the designs. Um, they had one in reference to golfing and they had a camouflage one. Those were the only other two that they had at that Dollar Tree. And I've only seen them at the one Dollar Tree. So if you score these, let me know. Um, they are, and it has green briar on the back. So, but it definitely does not look like a Dollar Tree product. That's for sure. Okay, moving on. want to show you i was so excited let me see if i can get them all out the bag okay you guys know i love my add-ins from a water so this is nothing new that i've bought this is a starbucks all pink there's six that come in here um i've hauled this one before this one's really really good i got that but this one i have not margaritaville strawberry daiquiri drink mix look at this there's two of them of course there's no alcohol in it add it to your water um it'll taste like a little virgin strawberry daiquiri so i found two of those look at that i absolutely love it and there is zero fat uh 40 milligrams of sodium three um carbs zero protein only 10 calories for this one um, but I absolutely love these and you can look on the back they all have a little bit different um, nutrition facts but they're all zero sugar so if you're trying to get your water in and you are struggling um, add some of the add-ins to it they it just it changes everything I've been using add-ins way before TikTok water was the thing I was already doing that um, and it just helps water go down a whole lot easier if you're struggling with drinking water um, and then I have, I found this. I'm hoping to go back and find another one of these. This is still Margaritaville Pina Colada drink mix. Again, zero sugar. I was so excited. I have Pina Colada, just the skinny syrup. And I like to add that to my pineapple add-ins. Tastes amazing. So um, I want to see what it tastes like with this. So we'll see. I don't know. But if you like add-ins, make sure you check out the Dollar Tree because... They'll surprise you. Sometimes they get flavors in that you can't find anywhere else. Um, so make sure you check them out. Okay, moving on. Let me pull out all of these. Wow, it's a lot. Okay, found some more stickers. I know my sticker box is over. It's overflowing. I've got to get a new box. Um, I'm just going to have a second box for stickers. I mean, why not? This is a 15 piece. This is by Jot. These are the puppy ones. But look at these. All the like the little motorcycles. I just thought that they were so cute. And my son absolutely loved them. So, pick that one up. This is my favorite. Turtles are my favorite. And this, that was 15 piece. This is 31. Look how cute those are. I love me some turtles. We actually have a turtle. Fun fact, don't know if I've ever told you guys, we have a Russian tortoise. His name is Toby. Um, he does think he's human. Um, he thinks he's a real person. Um, and we love him, and he is absolutely spoiled. But um, my son said, well, maybe we can put this on Toby's turtle box. I said, we'll see. <laughs> we'll see. I don't know. I don't know if they'll make it to Toby's turtle box because I absolutely love these turtles. are my favorite animal. All right, and then I found these. They're so cute by Jot. Again, this is 180 pieces. Um, usually I feel like my Dollar Tree has it where they're layered and I can like lift it up and show you guys. This one's not. This one's just a one piece. So it has the puffy stickers right here and then the other ones and then the letters and then these are the holographic ones. Um, leave me a comment. Don't you guys feel like your Dollar Trees usually have the ones where we lift it up so we can see all the different ones? Um, but this is the only one of this that I saw and I thought it was so cute. Um, so I grabbed it. Then I got by Jot the 30 piece. These are the monkeys. I have a daughter who absolutely loves monkeys. Um, so she wanted these. So I picked these up for her. So these will not go in my sticker collection. These will go to her. And then my son picked up these. It's 96 um, stickers. It says wham, kapow, crash, zap, boom, bang, zoom, pow. And he felt like he needed those. He absolutely loves stickers too. So pick those up for him. He has a little sticker book that he likes to put little stickers in. So got those for him. Okay. So you guys have heard me talking about a lot about 
um, scrapbooking and I am going to, oh, I found another sticker. Hold on, hold on. Before I finish that sentence, look at this. Look how cute that is. I absolutely love it. I can't even tell you which one my favorite one is because I just think it's adorable. And they're, um, they're pop-up ones. There's 15 count. And this is by Crafter Square. And it's the pop-up ones. The suitcases I just think are adorable. But anyway, that's another fact. Um, so as I was saying, I have been getting all kinds of scrapbooking stuff. I am going to share with you guys um, my scrapbook when I'm done and try to get some scrapbooking ideas together for you guys. I know I've been showing a lot of stuff on here, um, so I am going to do that. I am I am working on, on that idea. Um, so I wanted to show you some other things that I got for scrapbooking purposes. All right, so now's a good time, graduation. Um, to look for these cards and these cards are these are the the ones that I kind of showed you the same kind um, these are the 3d ones so all of these pop off like the 20 pops off the 23 pops off congrats you pop that off and then you have this red that you can use um, in your scrapbook to put your pictures on or little poems on or whatever you want to do you have all of that um, and so that's the reason I got this. I got this to deconstruct it, um, for scrapbooking purposes. Um, and maybe you, um, your kid plays sports and they're number 20 or they've been number 23. You can pop these off and use it for that purpose too. Um, and then of course the inside, you can always take words. This one says dream big, work hard, have fun. You could actually cut that out and it says make a difference. You could cut that out. Use that in your scrapbook. Um, you can take a card and completely deconstruct it and use it for something else. And in the back, this one has a cap. Um, the envelope, you can make pockets out of it for your scrapbook or for your journal. Um, so that's the reason I got this. So I thought this one was really, really pretty. So I got that. Um, then this one was actually supposed to be, and I apologize, I have a couple of these that was supposed to be in my haul from last time. Um, but I went to, when I went to the Dollar Tree, they actually still had the stand of these cards for Mother's Day. I don't know if they're discounted, um, but if you're using it for a scrapbooking or journaling purpose, it doesn't matter, just grab them. Um, but I found this one, look at this. There is so many things, oh my goodness, that you can do with this. The little, I, I just love the balloon animals. If you didn't see my last Dollar Tree haul, go back and check it out because I found a gift bag that was just like this. So cute. The cherry will pop off. The smiley face actually will pop off too. Um, but look how cute that are. Look how cute that is. Anyway. I'm a nurse, not an English teacher. Okay. Um, it says you are an amazing mom, but you could just, you are amazing. Like you can take out the and, or you can put something else there, or you are amazing. And if you don't, if you don't need to use mom, you could cover it up and put something else. Um, but you could also, again, pop off these items, use the background for, you know, pictures or, you know, a poem or something, a letter, whatever you want to put in your scrapbook. Look at the smiley face on the back. You can use that too. Um, on the inside, look at that. I mean, this itself is just darling. Like I absolutely love it. Um, loving you, mom is so easy to do. How could I not? You are you happy mother's day, but you could take some of these apart, cut them out, put them in your scrapbook. Again, just use this as an outline, put your picture there. Again, envelopes are great for like little pockets. So pick that one up. Um, <clears throat> so I did the same thing. Uh, all of these cards guys are for scrapbooking purposes. Um, so if you're not into that, go ahead and fast forward a little bit. Cause I've got just a couple more cards that I want to show you. This one says, yay, woohoo, happy graduation, great job. But all of these, you can pluck every last one of them off and use them for something else. And then you have this for your background. Um, the back isn't as great, again, unless you want to use the 20 or the 23, or unless 2023 means something special to you and you're putting it in your scrapbook for that reason. Um, and then look at this, celebrate party congrats grad but you could still cut these out use them so 
look at cards. Cards are a really, really good idea to use. I just noticed someone parked near me. I'm literally parked away from the store, like all the way away from the store. And it's not even really time for people to come in and now someone's parked next to me. Okay. It's okay. We're going to keep going. Um, anyway, this one is the same thing. This one is, look how pretty this is. This will pop off. Um, and you can use this for something else. And it does say 2023 on it. So again, if 2023 is something special to you, or maybe you want to use this, maybe you want to make a scrapbook from, you know, for your child from kindergarten all the way till they're a senior, um, or just their senior year or their high school years, whatever it is, guys, go to the Dollar Tree. I love to go to look <clears throat> at Hobby Lobby or Michael's and I like to look at their scrapbooking stuff. But then I'm like, you know what? I can find that at the Dollar Tree. And I, sure enough, I will go find something very similar, if not better, at the Dollar Tree. So, um, but again, you can pop that off. The diploma is not <clears throat> allergies. I'm sorry. The diploma is not like it's not 3D. You can't pop that off, but you can cover that up. Just remember that you can cover that up. Um, and then, of course, you can use the inside and cut the words apart and whatever you need to do. So there's that. All right, and then I have just a couple more cards. Um, this one, okay, it says beer, perfect birthday, binge watching. Okay, so I did not get it for any of this. I am literally going to cover it up. I just loved the background of the card, and that's what I'm using it for. Um, hope your day is filled with all the good stuff. You could use that, right? You could use that for something else. Um, you can also just use this and then recover it and put that on so it's kind of adds up like a pop-up on your scrapbook. Um, so I got that one. Then this one just says happy birthday again. You guys know I got it for scrapbooking purposes. Um, again, if you wanted to use the happy for anything, you could. You could cut it out. Let the good times begin and the fun never end. So again, look at these cards for other things besides a card. <laughs> Okay, it's early, guys. I am so sorry. All right. Um, and then the last card says, you're loved. But I loved the purple. I thought it was beautiful. You could use that, this too, just as it is. It doesn't even matter. It's beautiful. Um, and this is a Mother's Day card as well. But you can use that, again, for your scrapbooking, journaling, whatever you want to use it for. Okay. I needed a new grocery list pad. I'm sorry, this haul is getting really long. Um, and I loved the animal print and I love the fact that it's a magnet. I find some really cute ones and if it doesn't have a magnet, I can't, I can't really use it because we lose them. I'm going to be honest with you. We lose them. So there's that. All right. Oh, I found another set of stickers. This is what I'm talking about. Um, this is 78 from Jot. The kind, see, I lift it up and I can show you. Look at that. Yeah. So I've hauled one of these before. I'm not sure if I've showed you guys them or not, um, but I absolutely, I love it. I think it's so cute and you can use it for so many different things. So I got that. Let's see what else, what else? Um, and then I picked up another, this is one of the tall, um, the Rich Art acrylic paints, six fluid ounces. The green is gorgeous. So when I find new paint colors, I grab them. The paint, my kids love it. Um, I have some children that are, that love art and they said that the paint works really great. So I just continue to buy it when I see new colors. Okay. A few more things. Sorry. Bear with me. Just a few more minutes. Okay. Then I, we found this Crayola Miraculous. It comes with, um, seven markers or mini. It's by Crayola. So look at this. Like, it's so cute. And it's, again, Crayola, and it shows you all the pictures on the back. So we found that one. This was the only the only one that they had. Um, and then I needed to get another lighter for my candles, and I love this. The Croc Candy, the small one. I love it. I've not had really good luck with the, like the big ones. For whatever reason, they just, they stop working after a while and I, I don't know why, um, but I use them for my candles. So I needed, I needed another one. All right. And then, um, I found another one. This is hooray. This is another card. It was kind of in another bag. I'm going to pop this off because that is 
gorgeous and I can use it and it see it's the 3D. Um, again, you can use the back. You could use this. I love just the brown um, backing. Kind of looks like a paper bag. And then, of course, you have the beautiful, you got some stars here. So, guys, take your cards, use them um, for other things, even arts and crafts. Okay, last bag. Oh, my goodness, we're up to 20 minutes. Last bag. This will be quick. Um, got a, another pack of the cheese that Snapped. Um, there are four that come in here. Guys, these are kind of large. Um, for being at the Dollar Tree and my kids absolutely love these. So I got another pack of those. We got another pack of Junior Dippers. There's five that come in there. This is the one with the cheese. <clears throat> my son wanted us to put some more um, little treats in our cabinet. And so um, he picked out these marshmallow circus peanuts. And these come in a um, six ounce bag. So I got that. Um, one of my daughters wanted the Kit Kat minis. These are the unwrapped ones. <coughs> Excuse me. These are in the 2.3 ounces. And very last thing, we found these. I'm not even going to try to pronounce them, but these are the crackers. Um, these are three packs that come in here. Um, so we picked up these. I don't know. It looks like a Ritz. I don't know if it tastes like a Ritz, but we are going to try it out. It's heavy. It's 10.58 ounces. So pick those up for the kids to try. And that is my haul, guys. That was quite a bit of stuff. Um, I hope everyone enjoyed this video. If you are a current subscriber, thank you guys so much for all your love and support and your comments and your thumbs up. If you are not a current subscriber, I hope that you stay and subscribe. Um, also hit the notif the the notification. I don't even know what it's called right now because I'm literally so tired. But anyway, um, so hope you subscribe. I try to upload at least once. I'm trying to get better. Um, a work schedule in basketball has been crazy. So I'm trying to um, upload at least two or three times a week. I'm going to get better with that. I promise. So I apologize for that. Um, but anyway, give this thumb, this thumb, give this video a thumbs up. Um, and continue to watch so you can see me to stumble all over the words because that's what I do most of the time. Um, but I will see you guys. Oh, before I say that, um, don't forget, check me out on Instagram at find me and the clearance out. All right, guys, enough of me messing up words. I will see you on my next Dollar Tree haul. Bye guys.